Hi everyone, in this tutorial, we're gonna create a customized product page for our certain products. So I have several uh, customers asking me how to do this. Um, I'm doing this video to help them out. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go to online store and we're gonna go to teams and we're gonna edit this don team that I just added and we're gonna click actions and then edit code. And we're gonna, um, create a new copy of our sections, uh, product sections and our product template. So to do that, we're gonna go to our section folder, add a new section, and then we're gonna name this custom product. And you can name it whatever you want, uh, create a section. And then we're gonna open the main dash product this is for Don, but if you have different uh, team, you have to know what is your main product section. So we're gonna open the main dash product liquid. We're gonna control A to highlight, control C to copy, and we're gonna open the one that we created, custom dash product, and replace our code right here, control V to paste, and then click save on that one. Next, we're gonna create a template for our product. So we're gonna go to a template folder, we're gonna add a new template, and we're gonna click product in here. And question, what type are we gonna use? JSON or Liquid? Well, it depends on your team. If you're using uh, Liquid in here, um, then use Liquid. But for Dawn team, they're using the JSON for the dynamic uh, sections. So we're gonna use JSON in here and we're gonna change this alternate to custom. And then you can name it whatever you want, but for me, I'm just gonna name it custom. And then we're gonna create a template. And next we're gonna open the product.json or product.liquid for other uh, teams and click that. And then Control A to highlight, Control C to copy, and we're gonna open our product.custom.json again, and then we're gonna replace their, this code right here. So control V to paste. Now we have to replace the type. This is the, the name of the section that you created. So for me, I have custom-product.liquid. So we're just gonna replace the main product or the main word to custom. So click save. Now then we can do whatever we want on our custom dash product. So for me, I am just gonna customize my product title. So let's search uh, title. So here, this is our product title and I'm just gonna add a style. I'm gonna make it red. So style. And we're just gonna change the color to red. Okay, and then maybe we'll just change the font weight also. So it's bold. Um, okay, so that's it. And click save. And then we're going to go out from here. We're going to go all the way to our products. Uh, we're going to go all the way until we see the products right here. So click on the products. So then we're going to click this one product or any product you want. And for me, I'm just gonna click this uh, cap. And if we go down here on our online store team template, we're not gonna see the custom uh, template yet because we have to publish it. So go to your online store and we're gonna publish the one that we edited. So publish that and click publish. And then when we go back to our products again, we go to the cap and we should go to uh, team template and we're gonna see the custom uh, template right here. And click save on that one. And when we preview, we should see, yes, we should see the uh, title that is red, which I customized the custom product page or product section. But if you go to other products, it should be the same. And that's it, guys. That's how you do it to have a customized product page for a certain products only. And if you have any questions, let me know. And don't forget to subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.